gon' talk, we gon' have fun. We be on fire, we be lit lit. It's a unique hustle, big, big, big shit. Big shit, big shit, big shit. It's a unique hustle, nigga, big shit. Big shit, big shit, big shit. Name another podcast like this. Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique house. It's your boy ECEO, and I'm here with the lovely, amazing, official Miss Jamaica. What's going on? Not none of you, number Dale. Man, hey, man. It's good to see you again. Yeah, it's good yeah. to see you again. Stop see playing. Me again? You see me all the time. What you yeah, talking about? Yeah, but we sometimes, you know, we get caught so much in the work. When I see you in this light, you're just shining. Mm. Man, ain't God good? <laughs> yes, he is all the time. <laughs> check it, man. Hey, man, we got a, a young lady in here today, y'all. She don't really need no introduction, man. She been on uh, Boss Talk 101 uh, before um, her interview the last time she was on here. If you go back and check her out, man, you'll see what type of uh, energy, energy she brings. Um, and just the dopeness of her, the loyalty of her, the way that she, um, you know, uh, have been dedicated, man, love and the vibe, the boss talk movement, man. Check it, man. Terry Cherry's in the Terry building. Fucking Cherry. Terry, in the Cherry, man. What's going on? What's up? Girl, you so wild, man. You know it. Say, man, wh- I mean, you know, ever since we, we, we met, we mm-hmm. ended up, we decided to, you know, that we were going to hang out and, you know, really, really just, uh, you know, be a part of what you do, man. Mm-hmm. And we decided that, and it's been a lot of different things, a lot of different uh, things that done happened over the year. We went to Vegas. We went to Vegas. We went to Houston. Houston. We w- where, what else we do? We we just hung out. We went different places. We've been to different parties. You turned it out at that uh, DFW pop-up. Mm-hmm. You remember that? Yeah, I remember that. And she Man. started her house of cherry. Yeah. She started the house of cherry. I didn't, we, we didn't came so far. Y'all, listen. We got so much big. And now uh, the new generation with the boss talk. Woo! <laughs> Y'all just don't know how much that mean to me and just how much I've been pushing it. You know what I'm saying? Because that means a lot, especially for the new generation to come up and for us to get a platform to set our stones. Man, we finna go hard. Man, I mean, you, we already... People don't realize how much work is going on on the backside, Perch. man, the people that's so dedicated. And we, we got so much that we got that people don't know that's going on. And, and that's why I know it's something special because we're putting in that work mm-hmm. and building this foundation. Yeah. And a lot of people are talking about it. And like I say, without you, it, it doesn't happen. You, I thank you for everything that you've done. And Your I dedication. It. You motivating me, talking to me sometimes when everything seemed to be going crazy. I'd be like, I can always talk to Terry Cherry. And everything <laughs> seemed to just go away. You know what I mean? The problem ceased to, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So just tell us a little bit about uh, the House of Cherry and what, what, what you're planning with that Woo! whole movie. Let me tell you something, baby. For all the artists that's out there, we be going city to city, town to town, dust the dust. And we looking for that raw talent, you know what I'm saying, to put on that Boss Talk prime time. I'm talking about the people that got the talent, that's in these small places, that ain't got the money for it, that ain't got the, the light for it. We going down and digging deep, we asking. We looking mm-hmm. around for you. Now, I want you to know, now, if you got some talent, and you in a small place and you don't feel like that you got that shine, hit us up on Boss Talk Prime Time, man. Listen, man, go to the look, we wanna see. I wanna come, you know, we can from city to city with the thing. You feel me? We pushing this thing, man. Yeah. Um, you know, I, I like I said, I've seen the work. I know you went down mm-hmm. to South by Southwest. Yeah. And um awesome. I mean uh, uh, definitely how did you like that? Would it just was that your first time? It's a bittersweet thing, y'all, because y'all know uh-huh. I was shooting the house cherry. So we had um we had a good time with supporting each other, you know, making a change, going out, you know what I'm saying, uh doing uh concerts and stuff that we had like built up and it was a little bittersweet it's a little i ain't gonna lie it's a little drama action on there you want to check out the house cherry because it can go either way you know but i wanted to i really wanted to make it where we can make a change out of it you know what i'm saying take people and have them to come together and support each other they don't get the support you know what i'm saying from the outside world but we up there growing or some people who I already been on this for a long time. They feel like they ain't got the publicity and spot that they need. That's what I'm talking about. Top prime time is giving us a platform for that. You know what I'm saying? Especially in our little little neighborhoods where we come from. Everybody got different backgrounds, but right here on Boss Talk Prime Time. 
this new generation, it's where it's at, baby. I want to ask you about a, a, a something that I seen, and I didn't even know it. All the times you had been on here, I knew that you knew Smoothie, mm -hmm. but I didn't know that y'all had a song that y'all had done together. And I, you know, and what tripped me out was when I seen it, you were holding your own on it, man. And I just want yeah. you to give me a rundown on the process of that song and and kind of just tell me how it all transpired. Um, <clears throat> I don't lie, but um, that was my dog. You know what I'm saying? We, she, shoot, we came up together. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying. At that time, me and him was uh coming up with the songs from our different point of views and perspectives. At the time, you know what I'm saying? And we was trying to make something happen. You know what I'm saying? He did a little something called mixing emotions for me, and I did, you know, what them dollars it for him. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. You know what I'm saying? It it came to be how it is. I think we got like we got we got I think he got like like thirty one thousand on that mug. It's climbing too, you know what I'm saying? But um What was the whole process? Just the, the just run me down through there on on just the the, the song, some of the, the what was your give me a uh, just a, a what was your hook? You sung a hook on there. What was it? I'm that bitch named Cherry and I come with some beats. Want some bennies in my hand if you fucking with me. Niggas trying to get some pussy, I ain't fucking for free. No, my pussy got some pressure, better come with your feet. Need some guys in my account for you sending for me. Got to pay you for you, lay you when he fucking with me. That nigga know, he know me. He know, like, that's wrong. He know me, you feel me? So, yeah, you know man, what I'm saying? I just, I, like I said, when I seen you on that video, man, yeah. I was like, that's a dope video, and I know he brings the pain. I love yeah. Smoothie. Smoothie is a, a native from, from Boss Talk 101. Mm -hmm. I, I, I always call him up and chop it up with him, yeah. man. I go down, and when we interview him, I always, just always... Uh, be happy to yeah. get with him in the 15. How'd you feel about him signing 1501? Man, I think that was a great move for him. I've been new. He already told me beforehand, so I'm so glad that, you know what I'm saying, that, you know what I'm saying, Um, he, he got to this platform. We already knew that he was going to be who he is today, so, you know what I'm saying? But, Terry, worry about Terry. You know what I'm saying? So, but I'm still you know what doing I'm saying? what I'm you... I'm still supporting my dog. But would y'all ever work together again? Hell Yeah. Yeah. Hey, when he comes to us, Kevin, you know what I'm saying? I just, like I said, we went up to the Austin. I support my dog. Like, all Y'all linked up in Austin? Yeah, we linked up. So you made it? You talked with him? I went to the little 1501 event. I met um, Seco P. I met, man, uh, that's my boy, too. You know what? This is the first place Seco yeah. P ever interviewed, man. Oh, yeah? Yeah, your, this was your he second cool. interview, yeah, wasn't he it? he cool. Yo, this your second my, interview? This is my, my third. third. I'm no, I'm talking about when you first came on here. You had an interview before somewhere else, hadn't you? Yeah, well, he the HD. But you was nervous about this one. Yeah. <laughs> but you should, you you handled it. I handled this thing, man. I, I do this thing. So, so Seco P, uh, you ran into him down there as well, man. You, you are East Texas. So, you know, I ain't going to lie. Some people have got on here and said that you was the hardest female from East Texas. Yeah. I promise. Yeah. They done got on here and said that you was one of the hardest artists coming out of because of your versatility. Yeah. That you're versatile, you can do so many different things, and I think that's dope that they would even recognize you in that on that level. Man, I ain't never put myself in no box. I always thought whatever I can imagine, what I can do, and I try to apply it. Even if I don't know it, if I do know it, if I make a mistake, I know what to do better next time. But I always have my mind made on what I want, and I go get it. I don't think about it. I don't contemplate. If I say, okay, this is what I want to do, then this is what I'm gonna do. I put my actions to work. When I pray, I put action towards it. That's how I come true. You feel me? But everything, like, when I say prayer is real, and what I imagine in my mind, I know it's real. That's my testimony to show somebody else, like, whatever is all about the thought process and your words, like, what you speak out, you know what I'm saying? Spell, spelling, you know what I'm saying? Don't put a spell on yourself saying negative things. Speak positive yourself. You know what I'm saying? Nope. So I got to get that money, man. So... Let me ask you this about um, uh, just when we went to Houston. I know yeah. you went to Big Pup Studios. Big Big Pup is uh, one of my dogs. I love, love, <laughs> love Big Pup. Yeah, like like he he put he he he. The, how was that studio and the sound and just? Let me tell you something. If y'all ain't never met Big Pup, let me tell you something. The gentlest gangster I have ever <laughs> met. Is he single? No, he ain't. <laughs> well, I don't give a damn if you do. 
I'm by my way. <laughs> Something else. She ain't she? married. I'm, let me tell you something. I'm single. I'm, I'm outside this summer. I'm house of chairs. You, you don't see me. This you summer. don't see me going on little dates. You know what I'm saying? Trying to find my love. I, I got to find my love, too. Cut my love down. Come follow my... You know what I'm saying? We trying to get money together. But if you broke, don't even come to me. <laughs> just just stay at home. But you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You got something going for you. Say, come out with me. So, what what do you think about Terry Sherry when you think about it? Vi- vibrant. Very, very vibrant. Yeah. Her personality outshines everything. Oh. Man, we love her. That's that's the whole part about it. But but the thing is she works hard and she's she's independent. She she self motivates. She mm-hmm. don't have to have nobody to to, to hold her hand. Mm-mm. That's the type of person. You don't run into many people like that. No. She not she don't have a hand out. She don't mind going out there. She puts she a boss, she put her own money up. Mm-hmm. And she and listens. She listens. She 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 does what it takes. And and many people out here like Terry Cherry. And I, I, I wanted to commend you for that. That was one of the reasons I wanted Period. you to come back Let on Boss Talk. Um, I need y'all to go down low gumbo. Because Nessa's song dropped August first, and you don't want to miss Nessa's song because it is. I didn't got advanced. Y'all know, like I became a singer through my little transition, and you know what I'm saying. I came out of rap at first, but this is something that I'm growing into. This is something that I'm getting used to, and I know like this new album is gonna be something totally different. I ain't gonna be able. Man, listen, I'm telling you just like this. If you didn't believe in me, if you tried to play on my top, I'ma say God bless you. But I'm definitely you gonna see me. Do you understand what I'm saying? Understand? Look at that camera come close to me. <laughs> you gonna see me. If you tried to play me, you didn't wanna if y'all didn't wanna put me or mention me in y'all interviews, but I be mentioning you in your interviews, you gonna see me. If you was playing on my damn phone and tried to play on my top, you gonna see me. Man, but listen. I, I gotta ask you, like, do you feel like uh when you look at where the 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 art is today, where 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 music is today, that song "Wave" that you created, "Wave" was something different. I mean, when I first heard you, I heard "Wave." Mm-hmm. Uh, I actually I heard the other one first that that the one we went to the video shoot. Mm-hmm. What was that? What was the name of that song? Rubber Band Man. Rubber Band Man. And then somebody showed me "Waves," and and people every time I show them that song, man, they go crazy, mm-hmm. man. Like, what is your craziest uh, thing that you your, your just your feedback that you've gotten since you created that song? I got a lot of feedback. I just feel like because I switched over from heater to twine at the time, it's just a new transition. So I'm picking up a different audience from East Texas part. You know what I'm saying? But I'm telling you, it's going to catch up to it. It's going to catch up to it, and that's going to take off. Everything, like, if I look at my stuff that I did old, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm going to go check out my views and stuff like that. I can see that they coming up. But I do have a different mindset. I definitely don't want to be shooting videos and paying folks 400 or what's up. Not, not no slime to nobody. But at the same time, I know what I need to do to make me more money. You know what I'm saying? So I know for a fact, if you're an artist out there and you don't know, like, and you're shooting videos for folks, you're paying them three, four, five hundred dollars to shoot your video and they still making money off of it? Uh-uh. Let them know to give you that file. Give me my file and put it on your own channel. We just making people lots of money because we are so excited of trying to get these videos out and this content. But we just really making other people lots more money than what we can make. And that's taken from us. We got to wake up. You know what I'm saying? We got to stop being dumb, stop being ghetto, stop being lazy. We need to start researching and figuring the shit out for ourselves. You feel me? Because right now you're getting plucked in the butt. If you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying. No, I like it because I I think that's something me and R. P. Water Two Live. That was one of our last conversations about him yeah. trying to get his platform going for himself because it was it might start off to where your views might not look that promising, right? But if you keep working, if you keep being consistent, I guarantee you, God's not gonna let you plant seeds and there not be a harvest, right? So you just have to keep planting those seeds, those videos, that 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 uh, content, yeah. and you got to keep letting people know that you're a boss, and that's that's what you're doing. Yeah. And I just I like it, man. And I I know when we went down there to Houston, how was it working with Renetta Spencer? Man, I we made a we made a dope song. Hopefully, you know they put it out soon. You know what I'm saying? But definitely, that was dope. I felt like. If we was to grow with it, you know what I'm saying, that it'd be something. You know what I'm saying? I know Ronetta be busy or whatever like that, but I'm definitely, she you know. definitely I'm, busy. I, yeah. She, she got be, a song with Rick Ross. She booked and busy everywhere. Oh, her, Rick, her, her Rick Ross got a new yeah, song. Yeah, girl, go on and put that out. <laughs> go on and put it out. 
<laughs> she dope, man. I talked I talked to Ronnie yesterday. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we talk all the time. But you just, like I said, you you cut from a different cloth. And and I know you're very unique. And, and your mm. uniqueness is what's going to pave the way for you. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And um, I, how... Do you do you really uh do you really think that uh the w- will you be doing some more upbeat tempo songs here? In, Man, in I the got future? a little bit of everything. One thing about me is I like to always deep nab into something, and I always like to find something else that's different from what I did the first time. You know what I'm saying? So this new album, it got. I never can do anything without a story. I don't want to shoot a video without a story. I don't want to do a song if it don't have a purpose to it. I got to tell something, you know what I'm saying, something different. So that's definitely what I'm on right now. And then if you notice that everything that I've been doing getting greater, like bigger and bigger, you know what I'm saying? And I'm messing with me. Hey, man, it's all good. <laughs> I'm messing with me. It's going down, man. Da, 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 my gutter K voice. You, you know what, gutter K, when, I, when you seen that I had interviewed gutter K, K, call me. Say, okay. <laughs> you love Gutter K. You like I love what? Gutter what K. Made, you see in his video is doing real well on yeah. on our channel. Man. His interview, like, I I, and I don't think I don't really think that he have a lot of interviews out there. That's what we yeah. do. We bring people on here and we 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 sit them down. Shout out to that boy, old boy Prince, man. man. One of the dopest dudes, man. Uh, I love the way that he he rock out with Boss Talk One Hundred One, but yeah. he the one C Four S Gutter K is a part of C Four S, yeah. And he had hit us up and and we interviewed uh, Gutter K and man, I mean, it did better than all, all of I a lot say of interviews. Is, Gutter K, can you tell me why Million come out there help his friend fight? Because <laughs> I was watching, I was like, uh uh-uh. uh. And yeah, he say we're hiding behind the bush, but I see you talk trash about you. Oh, we ain't finna let that happen, baby. And you know, I, I like Jonathan too. So you, you ride or die, saying? Gutter K? Yeah, I'm riding down with Gutter K. He from, is she from Texas? He is no, from. No, he from ooh, Michigan. I'm finna say, he from Michigan. But he be really, he been in Texas a long he, time. I don't cry, I've been watching him for a long time. I like him better, and I can choose, okay? Because who gonna, who gonna whoop me? Okay, because we don't see Jonathan come beat your ass again. So who going to whoop? I'm just playing, y'all. I'm just watching. I'm just Girl, watching you, enjoy, you can tell you be watching that show a lot. I do. You know, you know the uh, new episode just dropped today. I just feel I just feel like on the new episode that I've been watching, they like, why did Jonathan leave? I know he was a little bigger of a threat. But at the same time, y'all weren't saying that when me alone was, you know what I'm saying, beating up everybody else. Y'all weren't saying nothing that, you know what I'm saying? Girl, you, you big, know what I'm big fan. Okay, and then y'all ain't finna play with Gutter because we gonna come back and jump you with him. Okay, stop playing with him. Okay? So let me let me pull you back in, man. Mm-hmm. God, dog, you so. I'm I mean, like I'm on the show, but you dope though. I mean, your heart goes out to whatever you put it toward, and you one of those people For who sure. you got the right energy, man. So, yeah. I, how do people get a hold of you if they trying to follow you man, on, listen, on your Instagram? I'm and gonna tell all y'all, that. y'all hit me up on Boss Talk Prime Time. You hey, be, you ain't gonna be able to. You ain't gonna be. Able, I ain't going to no show I ain't, I ain't gonna be able to make no song do no feature you can't you can't get at me if you don't go to boss talk prime time and wow. me it I come baby you just got to that's what you got to do that's what you got to, don't hit me up hit them up don't hit me up I'm on a different bracket I don't do that two three hundred dollars no more no we didn't did that already. Stop playing with me. I didn't did my part already. Yesterday's prices is not today's Listen, price. Listen, I didn't did my part already. Stop acting like y'all don't see me. I'm not doing nothing for free. I'm not trying to be funny with nobody, but I didn't did so much work. I'm over it. You know what I'm saying? Nah, Period. Point blank. I get it. Well, you know already you you ride or die with me. So Perfect. whatever they, what they, 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 money got to be right. Money got to be. And you know, you, you, got, you got kids to feed. Man, what? Stop playing. Y'all see me with these celebrities? <laughs> Quit playing with me. You know what I'm saying? You, you dope as hell, man. Per. So, I mean, thank you for coming on Boss Talk 101. Man. Once again, we love you, man. And, and your energy, I always write. Like I said, I, I I just was thinking like, dang, you know, like, I got to get Terry Terry back on here, man. man. Because you, you without you, man, this thing, this, the, the heart don't beat, Can I, baby. Let me, let, before this, let me tell y'all, the house chair is coming out, and y'all go like, subscribe, and follow all the pages. Go uh, follow the house chair. Follow the house chair um, Facebook, Instagram, you know what I'm saying, Twitter, all of it. Go follow. Go follow Ball Star Pride Time so y'all can watch it. I'm telling you, Tessa Canna, we... 
I got a whole new era for Tessa County. Color Louisiana, I got a whole new era for them. For us to show what we got, what type of talent we got. Like, for real, there's some real talent in Texas County. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's just, they had a picks and chooses, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And people, like, certain people, they do certain things, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Where, how many times, I'm going to ask you this, how many times you see, how many, how many people that you interviewed from Texas County and you asked them, how many good artists and they had they picks and choosing a two or three or five of who they felt like was the best? You feel me? How many people that you know that? Now, they know there's talent out there, but they don't want to say them names. They got their picks and choosers. But see, one thing with me, I'm going to do what I want to do. I'm going to make my own name. I don't need nobody else. That's one thing. I never piggyback off nobody else. I want to get that straight. I never piggyback off nobody else, but I will never let nobody play with me either. I want to get that straight. Like, I never let nobody play with me. It's so many things we can do, but it's so many haters, man. Like, it be so many haters. It be the same people you working with that be haters. You know what I'm saying? So, I feel like what I'm trying to do, I'm going to push through regardless. Like, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't care if nobody said, like, I'm on a different platform where I can take it to another level. You know what I'm saying? Now, that's where they got me messed up at. You feel me? And they, they sleep on me. But I'm really woke. You know what I'm saying? So, I I'm think ready. it says a lot when you go out and perform. Period. When you perform, everybody's looking at you. Yeah. And they saying that you're the best to do it. And, and, and that says a lot in itself. When people yeah. are calling you saying, when you are being looked at and I'm hearing that you, the dopest artist, and yeah. all type of stuff like that, you should be proud of yourself. I am, and 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 you you can't listen to what other people saying because they ain't, they you you know uh, Jay Z said uh, uh, one time in a, in a song he say I'm in the air yeah I don't hear niggas corny raps on me you know like he's saying I'm flying so high up right that I can't understand what's going on down there right so a lot of times if you just if you just focus on your level yeah and in your wavelength. Then, then everything else got to get in line. Shoot, I am. So you thank you so much, man. And you can't, and like I said, you know already why we, how we doing it. You already so, know. So, hey, man, uh, so much more to come from Terry. The, Terry Cherry is one of them ones, man. The House of Cherry is something special. Yeah. I, you guys better start tapping in Terry Cherry. The tap. music is coming. Y'all heard us announce yeah, Gumbo. Tap. So, man, hey, man, say, man, thank you so much. You hear me? It's been another great segment of On Boss, Boss Talk, Talk 101, 101. <laughs> where the bosses talk. And we are. Uh, we are.